Hey kids, have you seen have like dinosaurs and prehistoric animals? There were doing us. So let's get started. Card 1. Monsters of the Past T-Rex The terrible Tyrannosaurus Rex T-Rex was a real-life nightmare for a Thirdinosaur more than 65 million years ago. Not only was it huge, but it stood upright and could run fast with long strides. Don't mess with Mr. T. T-Rex towered over him, most other dinosaur and had a really big head, its skull and jaw alone measured over five feet in length. Little legs, the dinosaur's front legs had little use. They were too short to reach its mouth and had only two claws for grasping. Creature feature species, Tyrannosaurus rex size, height up to 16.5 feet, length up to 37 feet, weighed up to 14,000 pounds. Where, fossils have only been found in Earth America pre, other dinosaurs, dead or alive, body parts, strong legs and huge jaws with six in teeth. This is wrong. <laughs> Card 2. Monsters of the Past. Stegosaurus. Stegosaurus was a slow-moving, pea-brain plant-eater. That fought back vicious predators with a huge sharp, spike tail. A lash from Thistinosaurus rear and could be fatal. Spiked punch, Stegosaurus spikes made its tail though. Equivalent of a medieval mace. And it was just as deadly, since it was a plant eater. The dinosaur likely used the spikes only in defense of itself and its young. Stumpy, Thistinosaurus legs were like an elephant's. Built to carry massive weight, the front legs were shorter and allowed. The dinosaur to graze vegetation easily along the ground. Creature feature species, Stegosaurus armatus. Size, length up to 30 feet, weight up to 4,400 pounds body parts, mammoth body. Spikes on back and tail, little brainware, fossils have been. Found in Siberia, China, India, Western European North America food, Soft Vegetation Card 3 Monsters of the Past Dunkelsteus For a hundred million years ago, long before the dinosaurs woke the earth, Dunkelsteus was at the top of the world's food chain, one of Thephyr's jawed animals on the planet. This prehistoric arm redfish attacked its prey with bone-crunching ferocity. Nope. But it's not a dinosaur. Muscle Man. This fish's body was bulky and extremely muscular. It needed muscular power it sold through the water when I tatic prey. Bonehead. Dunkelsteus' skull was made of several pieces of thick bone, giving it an armor plating that no other creature could break through. Creature feature Eschinus, species, Dunkelsteus, various, size, lent up to six meters weight up to one thousand prey. Primitive sharks and fish wear. Fossils have been found in the eastern U.S., Germany and northwestern Africa one, for 110 to 350 million years ago. Card 4. Monsters of the Past. Apatosaurus. With a massive body and elongated neck, Apatosaurus fed from the tops of trees or other dinosaurs couldn't reach after a herd of. These huge grazing dinosaurs tramped through an area. They left a wake off destruction like Adornado, with upturned air tank, tree shattered into pulp. Tino Light, this creative's neck was relatively light because its vertebrae were hollow, otherwise, its neck would have been too heavy to lift. Whipped, the long and muscular tail helped protect against predators. Its move it so fast that when thirst about, 
it would have a produced a loud crack and a crushing sting like age and bullwhip. That's so cool. Wait a minute. Why the Apatosaurus have sharp teeth? He doesn't like a T-Rex. Creature feature species. Apatosaurus lausia. Size. Length up to 70 feet. Weight up to 33 tons food. Vegetation. Such as palm leaves where. Fossils have been found in the western United States. Body parts. Huge body long neck. Whip-like tail. Card 5. Monsters of the Past. Eurypterids. Looking like a cross between a lobster and a giant scorpion. Eurypterids were terrors of the ancient Paleozoatsias. These predators could reach sizes as big as a human and used giant. Pincers to grab and crush victims. Among the largest arthropods that ever lived, Eurypterids were probably the first. See creature resto venturianto land. Claw power. Spiked claws were the Eurypterids' best weapons. They were sharp enough to slice smaller fish in half and strong enough to hold larger prey in a death grip. Row, row, row. Theoripterid's fifth pair of legs was long and broad. The animals used these legs like oars, which helped them move swiftly through their watery habitats. Creature features family, Eurypteracha. Size. Length from one in to 6.5 feet pre. Worms, other invertebrates and fishware. Most fossils have been found in North America and Europe when, from 510 to 245 million years ago, in the Paleozoic era sound off, you ripped a rid. Card 6. Monsters of the Past. Synagnathus. A cross between a dog and a lizard. Synagnathus was of the top predators of its time. These fierce animals hunted in packs, using their sharp teeth and powerful bodies to drag down prey. Synagnathus had so many similarities to mammals that Chintus believed that this creature gave rise to all modern mammals. Synagnathus, what's up? Did you say what? Who say what? More than a mouthful. This was one of the first animals, with specialized teeth. Two pointed canines stabbed into a victim's, and the rest were sharp incisors that sliced through meat. Pack attack, Synagnathus was relatively small, but that didn't stop it from tackling huge prey. Attacking in groups, one beast would clutch the victim's, throw in its jaws, while the other store away at the prey's back and stomach. Creature feature species. Synagnathus crater on notice. Size. Length up to five feet body parts. Long canine teeth. Powerful jaws and muscular legs. Prey. Any other animals where. Fossils have been found in South America, Africa and Asia sound off. Synognathus. Card 7. Monsters of the Past. Giant Sloth. Thousands of years ago, during Thearth's last ice age, the giant sloth drudged through North and South America. This huge, hairy beast waist size of an African elephant, and though it was mostly a gentle giant, it had claws that could fight off any predator that was brave and auto attack. Seems about right. Cleanse Weep. Thegent Sloth had twelve inch claws on its front feet and used them for stripping leaves off off branches. The claws also came in handy as powerful stabbing weapons if a predator came around. Stand Tall. This beast could walk on all fours or on just its hind legs. When I treared up the sloth tower at a height of 16 to 18 feet, and could grab food from the tops of trees. Creature feature species, Megatherium americanum, size, linked up to 20 feet, weighed up to 4 tons body parts, 
huge claws, strong legs, food, vegetation from shrubs and trees, may have scavenged meat, where fossils have been found in Earth and South America. Card 8 Monsters of the Past Carnotaurus A hundred million years ago, the plains of South America were home to one of the strangest-looking dinosaurs ever. The beast called Carnotaurus had horns like a bull and scully skin that was covered with bony bumps. More than twenty feet in length and a ton in weight, it could run fast for short stretches, but this big creature was more bully than beast. It tended to feast on the kills made by other predators and only attacked small prey. Junior meals, some of Carnotaurus' fetters are puzzling. Its forward-pointing eyes and sharp teeth show that Thednosaur was a predator. However, its lower jaw was weak and its teeth were thin. Carnotaurus probably only preyed in small, plant-eating dinosaurs. What is this thing? Yup, I think it is but because it actually a Disney character of Carnotaurus. Big Brute Carnotaurus was definitely a bully. Thednosaur used its size to frighten packs of smaller, meat-eaters away from their kills. This way, Carnotaurus didn't save to do any of the work. Okay, I'm sorry Carnotaurus didn't like that. Nope. Creature feature species. Carnotaurus sastri. Size. Length up to 24 feet. Height up to 9 feet. Weight up to 2,000 to 100 pounds. Prey. Smaller dinosaurs. Dead or a lavoir. Fossils have been found in Argentina sound of Carnotaurus. No, no, no. I will suck you up. Card 9. Monsters of the Past. Amergosaurus. Amergosaurus was one of the most unusual looking dinosaurs to ever roam the earth. To rows of bony spikes ran down its neck like O pointed mane, and its nostrils were located at the top of its head. With its large sizing spikes, the creature could fight off some of the fierce predators that Cretaceous buried. Totool. Each of Amargosaurus feet had done or two elongated claws on the inside edge. These claws may have a helped the animal fight off smaller but persistent radars with quick kicks. Peg tooth, amergas roosteth were long and blunt rather than sharp because they were not used for chewing. When the dinosaur clissed its mouth around a branch and pulled it through these teeth, the leaves stripped off easily and slid down. The Dinosaur's Throat Creature Feature Species Amergosaurus Kazawi Size Length up to 40 feet Weight up to 5 tons body parts Long neck with To lines of spikes peg like teeth Bulky body Food Any available vegetation where Fossils have been found in western Argentina sound off ah. Margosaurus Card 10 Monsters of the Past Megalodon Megalodon is the great-grandfather of the top history, shark living toddy, the great white. But Megalodon was a bigger double dose of jaws, and then some. Megalodon measured more than twice as long as the biggest great. White hand weighed about forty for tons more. This monster sliced through mum prey, mainly whales with 
its teeth each with anal tresharp, saw tooth edge. I D K, what this thing? Oh yeah, I think it's the Megalodon for Movi, but it's Jaws. Tale of the Teeth Almost all of what scientists know about Megalodon comes from its fossil azetith. The largest of the shark's triangular teeth are seven inches long, more than twice the size of Thegreet White's teeth. Now those are jaws. With such large teeth, the shark needed massive jaws to hold them. Scientists have recreated Megalodon's jaws, which measured six feet wide. The shark could have swallowed a horse in one gulp. Creature feature species, Carcharodon megalodon, size, length up to 55 feet, weight up to 48 tons body parts, whopping tail, monster teeth, massive jaw spree. Prehistoric whales where fossils have been found off the coast of the Americas, Europe, and Australia. Card 11. Monsters of the Past. Triceratops. With its massive three-horned head, Triceratops was a heavy weight among dinosaurs. Few predators would dare attack this powerful animal for fear of its long, sharp, deadly horns, legs strong to support its massive body. Triceratops had powerful legs, similar toned elephants. The dinosaur weighed about as much as to school bosses. Triple threat. The three horns of Triceratops were made of keratin, the same substance from which our own finger nails are made. The horns above these were the longest, reaching a length of about three feet. Creature feature species Triceratops oridus, size, length up to 30 feet, weight up to 19,000 pounds body parts, armor plated frilled, head with three horns and a sharp beak, food, foliage and bark on trees habitat, forests in western United States and Canada. Okay guys, why is Triceratops is so dark? But because is black. No, no, no. Shut up, dude. What did you say? But because is too dark. Oh. Stop that. Just kidding. Of course we have the footage. This is the creature see people. They got footage the inside in your mouths. Card 12. Monsters of the Past. Diplocolis, with a head shaped like a stealth bomber and a body like a salamander. Diplocolis was an unusual creature that roamed ancient waterways even before dinosaurs appeared. The triangular shaped skull helped this creature race through the water at top speed. An amphibian. This ancestor of modern salamanderdal also slog through muddy swamps with its hort legs. Dit of a stretch, Diplocolis most unusual feature is its boomerang-shaped head, measuring up to 16 inches in which this would have made the creature hard for many predators to swallow. Mouth first, in the front. Of this creature's head was a thin mouth. It was small, but lined with several rows of sharp teeth that made it easy for the plocolus to tear pieces all flesh from its prey. Creature feature Eschinus, species, diplocolus, various, size, linked up to 4.3 feet, 
weighed up to 33 pounds body parts. Why? Triangular head, flat body, webbed feet pre. Fish and insects swear. Fossils have been found in Texas and Oklahoma sound off. Tip Locolas. Card 13. Monsters of the Past. Allosaurus. T-Rex's great-grandfather. Allosaurus set the standard for generations of ferocious, prehistoric predators. Sharp Colossan is front arms to rain to prey, all rows. Of sharp teeth stripped away chucks off meat. The top predator on land, Allosaurus ruled. The Jurassic world for about five million years. Hard head. This dinos large skull had bony ridges over each eye. And another ridge from the forehead to thesnat. Its gaping jaws were filled with sixty jag teeth. Balancing act. Allosaurus upper body was so big and heavy that it needed a long tail to act as a counterbalance. Otherwise, it would have a constantly fallen on its face. Creature featureskinus. Species, Allosaurus, various. Size, length up to 40 feet, height up to 16 feet, weight up to 11,000 pounds. Where, fossils have been, found in North America, Africa, Europe and Australia pre, other dinosaurs. Allosaurus was not the ancestor of T-Rex. Card 14. Monsters of the Past. Saber-toothed tiger. Thousands of years ago, the saber-toothed tiger terrorized animals across the plains of North and South America. Thetiger attacked its prey with huge canines. Slashing the victim and th necker ripping gain to the soft underbelly. No, saber toothed tiger was not first of the dinosaurs. Short stuff, the tiger's tail was short, unlike other predatory cats, such as cheetahs, which use their tails for balance during a chase. The saber toothed Tiger didn't run down prey but preferred to ambush the victim. Needs braces, the long canine, teeth were similar to tusks and stuck out when the tiger closeted its mouth. Modern cats have a spike canines, but not nearly as long as this feline's. Creature feature species, Smilodone fatalis, size, Length up to five feet, weight up to 450 pounds where fossils have been found in North and South America pre large mammals body parts, huge jaws, seven in canines and resort sharp claws. This cat isn't really a tiger. <laughs> Card 15. Monsters of the Past Tasmanian Wolf Killing at night with a bone-crunching bite The Tasmanian Wolf decimated sheep herds and struck fear and outrage into sheep farmers. Superstitions have arose that this wolf craved blood like a vampire. The animal was eventually hunted to an early extinction. Big Mouth the wolf could open its jaws enormously wide, at an angle of over 160, much wider than a normal wolf. The animal's powerful jaw muscles helped it smash through the bones of its victims. Invisible Stalker, dark stripes, numbering 9 to 13, started at the middle of the back and ran down its body along the tail. They provided camouflages the wolf watched for, prey from the shadows. Creature feature species, Thylacinus cynocephalus, size, length five to six point to feet, to feet tall at shooter, weight up to 77 pounds, body parts, wide jaws with strong teeth, striped back habitat, Tasmania. An island off southern Australia pre.
kangaroos, wallabies, sheep, when species dates back to 23 million years ago, became extinct in mid-1930s. And then, did you know, but does not to check out the video to watch, but because of you get very warning, can you check out? Yes. Yup, the warning is pass away. Hey Sharon, it's me Benjamin. Today's September 3rd, 1933, and I'm somewhere in Australia. Oh, sorry, I'm so tired. Oh, they've been treating me like a damn canine out here. I'm a marsupial. Uh, yeah, I kind of miss my family. Even though Thanksgiving was a nightmare. Tiger side always stole from the Tasmanian side. Poor little Timmy. Whoa! Oh, thought I saw a kangaroo over there. Hey, whoa, whoa. What are you doing over there, mate? Oh, man. I tried to explain to them. Marsupials are nocturnal, but they just don't listen, man. It's damn near 2 o'clock. Goddamn afternoon. Wouldn't do this to an owl, would you? Told him half tiger, half Tasmanian. That means cat like reflexes, and I can. <laughs> yeah, this is Wallaby, three clicks east. See? I'm amazed. Oh, wait, itchy stripe. Card 16 Monsters of the Past. Trilobites. Trilobites swarm through the ancient seas 500 million years ago. These arthropods, a group that include as modern crabs and lobsters with theferst animals known to have eyes, this enabled them to see their surroundings and hunt few a modern sea creatures do now. Trilobites survived in the oceans for 300 million years, making them one of the longest surviving species in history. Bottom Feeder Thetralobite's body was divided into as many as forty for segments. Under each segment was a pair of legs. These jointed limbs help the creature scurry quickly along the seabed where it found his food. Cole Hemgill also attach toed legs wear a thread like filaments that act as gills. They were in it very efficient. So trilobite needed a great number of these gills to absorb the oxygen it needed from water. Creature feature species, various size, length up to 2.5 feet. Prey, plankton, worms, and other trilobites. Where fossils have been found everywhere Azia once existed. Sound off. Try. Low bite. Oh, wait a second. Oh, my God, and there is a video making animatronic trilobite. This video looks cool. Just watch. Oh, wow, your wheels look like a car. Oh wow, that's a type of legs. Oh wow, he made build. And now but is done. These trilobites are so cool. You can make other different crazy trilobites. Just kidding. These robots are crazy. The creature looks cool, but how do you think about it? Card 17. 
Monsters of the Past Trinodon This strangely designed flying reptile soared through the skies in prehistoric times and swooped down to feed and fish. Pteranodon shed, including thetal crest, was longer than its body, and its wingspan was wider than a small modern airplane. Pelican-like, Trinodon's spake was long and sharp, piercing through waves to grab food. Like a pelican, it may have had a large epitch underneath an, which to store fish. Thin skin. Tranodon's wings were made from a strong but light and flexible membrane off skin. This allowed Thenimal to float easily on the air and glide, rather than having to continuously flap its wings. Creature feature species, Trinodon sternbergi. Size, up to 45 pounds, wingspan up to 30 feet. Where? Fossils have been found in parts of Kansas, which was once an inland sea, prey, prehistoric fish, body parts, wide wings, hoogby, like a cross between a giant bat and a pelican. Part 18. Monsters of the Past. Giganotosaurus. The largest predator to ever hunt on land, Giganotosaurus, was just like its name gigantic. Up until 1993, T-Rex was considered thinking of the dinosaurs. But the discovery of Giganotosaurus conked T-Rex out of the top spot. Giganotosaurus were four feet longer, stood six feet taller, and weighed to tons more than its Iandricusin. Head case, with a head that was almost six feet long, Giganotosaurus, could have swallowed a human adult in one gulp. The beast had problems looking forward, though, as bony ridges on the skull reduced its forward vision. Fish teeth, this creature's teeth were thin and sharp, with jagged edges and resemble the teeth of modern-day sharks more than blunt, rounded teeth of T-Rex. Creature feature species, Giganotosaurus carolini. Size, height up to 23 feet, length up to 41 feet. Weight up to 9 tons. Prey, other dinosaurs. Where, fossils have been found in Lee in Argentina. When, 100 to 95 million years ago. Just try. <laughs> Card 19. Monsters of the Past. Kalimimus. Light bones and strong muscles made Kalimimus the fastest dinosaur of its day. This creature lived in dry, open plains and used its great speed to spread away from hungry predators such as the meat eating Tyrannosaurus. Toothless Terror. Gullimimus beak like mouth enabled it to eat a varied diet. It could strip leaves from branches just as easily as it could peck at insects and lizards on the ground. Flexoneck, like a modern day ostrich, Gullimimus neck was long and flexible. Prey in its dessert like habitat was scarce but swift pecking motions gave this dinosaur the agility it needed to snatch up small, quick creatures. Creature features. Species. Gallimimus bolatus. Size. Length up to 18 feet. Height up to 10 feet. Weight up to 550 pounds. Prey, plants, eggs, insects, and small lizards. Where? Fossils have been found in Mongolia. When? 75 to 70 million years ago during the Cretaceous period. Card 20. Monsters of the Past. 
Archaeopteryx. Archaeopteryx is a blend of different creatures, sharing traits of both dinosaurs and birds. The oldest feathered flying animal ever discovered. Archaeopteryx shows that Tade's feathered wren were probably at one time Meister Dacerupt. Body of a bird, the fossilized. Feather impression of Archaeopteryx looks similar to the feathers of modern birds. Jaws of a reptile. Rather than a beak, this creature had skin cover a jaw as the jaws were linted with sharp, pointed teeth, like other meat eating dinosaurs. Claws of a bat. Three claws stuck out from each wing, similar to thiefingers of a bat. They were used for climbing among thebranches of trees. Creature features. Species. Archaeopteryx lithographica. Size. Length 14 in. Weight less than 1 pound. Wingspan. About 1.5 feet. Where? Fossils have been found in thephrists of southern Europe. Prey. Insects and small lizards. Okay. Archaeopteryx want to get count or get jump scare. But this is worse it's going to a warning in. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ah! Thanks for watching.